this is the eighth. And as you've seen, the first week was pretty much health food for the most part, salads, omelets. Uh, I did have some chicken and things like that that weren't so healthy, but that's okay. Let's see how much I weigh at the beginning of week two. One ninety six point two. To be honest, kind of feel bloated, so some of that might be water weight, but I lost a pound. Let's see how we do when we don't eat healthier food and just eat whatever we want. That'll be this next week. And we're going on vacation this week, so could see how to not gain weight on vacation, I guess. Okay, this is meal one, day eight. Uh, changing the week up to eat whatever I feel like eating instead of the health food like omelets and salads. First day is sausage biscuits and pop tarts and a grape. Okay, here is meal number three, day eight. Look at this shit. I bet you I still lose pound this week, but look, little peppermint things and some fruity pebble candy bar and a pie of some sort. Here, I want a bite of it. Oh, look, it's eight. Mm. Oh, banana cream. All right. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. Right. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> it was eight ounces. Bye. Here's mill one, March ninth. Sausage biscuits and a pot. All right, here is meal number two on the 9th of March. Just a couple burritos, eight ounces even for two burritos. All right, meal number, this is actually three because I skipped meal three, pizza. Some of that low carb cauliflower pizza and a piece of regular pizza. March 10th, meal number one, Lego my ego with some peanut butter on them and syrup. All right, today is the 10th and I'm eating my son. He had this in the fridge cause he didn't eat the other day. So it's hard as a rock um, and a grape and some chicken nuggets, I guess is what they would be. But this second meal on the 10th. All right, the scale went to zero, so I missed the actual video of the way, but there's 8.1 ounces of just beans and cornbread. All right, here is meal number four, and this is the 10th of March. We got some baked pork roast, some rice, and some green, bean, green beans, and I'm drinking some pop pineapple soda today. Right, here we go for dinner or for kind of like a midnight snack and say it's way past midnight but right before bed i drank like three or four of these or two or three actually i think i only drank two but this is the beer munchies as long as i'm not going overboard i'll be all right hey guys what's up Stay home dad here, it's 11th March and uh, today we will be leaving for vacation. Last night I drank two, I'm pretty sure just two, but maybe three uh, alcohol, whatever, those truly a things. They're actually not that bad, but I got pretty buzzed off just two, uh, considering I haven't drank since last year. And two's about all I wanted. I didn't really want any more. So, uh, 
I don't really think I gained a lot of weight. And last night, as you did see, I did eat at midnight as 12 o'clock meal. Uh, I miss those a lot because I fall asleep usually. Well, I was wide awake last night till about one. Got up about six. Went for my walk. Lifted some weights. Felt pretty good this morning. I didn't have a hangover. Goes to my theory that maybe the hangovers is just from the binge eating after you drink. Because uh, usually what I'd do is I'd probably eat 30, 40 ounces of food after I drink. Well, last night I ate down eight ounces and went to bed. Crashed just fine. Uh, so let's see where we're at on our weight. One ninety-five point eight. I'll go with that. So not only did I not get a hangover last night when I drank alcohol, I didn't really binge eat, and I didn't gain any weight. I actually lost weight. So that makes me a little bit happier. I was kind of feeling that I'd be back up to 200, and that's always brings you down a little bit when that happens. But I feel pretty good. Let's see what we're having for breakfast today on the 11th. Just some raisin bran with some artificial sweetener. Eight ounces. Mar March 11th on meal number two. Road pork roast sandwich and Vienna sausages. All right guys, here we are on 11th, fixing to go on vacation. This is meal number three, four o'clock. Chicken strips, eight ounces of chicken strips. Oh, some pretty heavy chicken strips. I'm fine with that. Gas station surprise here, pizza and Krispy Kreme donuts and little cookies. This is meal number four on the left. This is 12th, this is breakfast, we're still on the road. Second meal, well, third meal, I guess. No, second meal. A couple sandwiches and some cheese poofs and Pringles. All right, here we are, third meal. It's late, it's like five o'clock, I guess. And it's all kinds of stuff. Sandwich, animal cookies, Doritos, pretzels. All right, I got some kind of taco salad kind of thing. It's from Taco John's here in Montana. Eight ounces. Here we go, meal one on day 13 on vacation out here in Montana. Just leftovers, some like potato things, and my stuff from last night, eight ounces. No walk this morning. Right. Meal number two on the 13th sandwich and chocolate and some pop quarters, whatever those are. Some kind of healthy chip up here. Never fried. Never fried. Mm. Seven point. All right, it's the thirteenth. Mail three. As you can see, I wanted donuts and some Reese's dip puzzles up here in Montana, and some grapes. Eight ounces. All right, guys. I'm gonna break the diet. We're uh having s'mores and I still gotta eat dinner so it's probably gonna make me shit a lot but it's not a s'more it's a smoky uh, how do I toast the marshmallows hold on hold on you don't burn yourself but this ain't dinner this is just snack so I'm gonna break it a bit plus I ate some chips and stuff alright we're gonna make s'mores alright Here's fourth meal, and I didn't eat that whole uh, morgue. You gave it? it to me. What was it? Uh, it was a smoky. A smoky. What? I only ate half of it. What three? And eat? this is actual dinner. You can see eight point one, but I mean, like, I've already had eight point one, so I didn't wait on that. All right, it is twelve in the morning on Monday the fourteenth. This is actually fifth meal for. The 13th sandwich and a big donut with chocolate. All right, here is breakfast donut and a cherry pie with a glass of milk. 8.3. Okay, this is meal number two. 
and just ramen noodles. And I'm going to drink a smoothie too. Here's the smoothie with the lunch I was talking about. Krista made for us. I'm going to try it out. Mm. Okay, this is meal number three. A burger. At I don't have a scale. All right, and here we go with fourth meal. On the 14th, we got eight ounces of pizza. All right, guys, here's the fifth meal to Monday the 14th, but it's actually 12 a.m. on the 15th. Just leftover pizza. I did drink one of these before I ate it though. But that's it. Alright, here is breakfast. Eight ounces. We've got fruit pie, cinnamon roll, grain cracker, some pretzel crumbs, and a glass of milk. Alright, guys, here is meal number two on the 15th. I already started eating and I forgot to make the video, but. It's fish patties and or fillets and uh, fries. Meal number four on the fifteenth, I think. Yep. Ham sandwich with a cherry pie before somebody crushes it. All right, we got the 16th and just four toaster strudels. Yay. All right, here is meal number two. Just a couple sandwiches, eight ounces. All right, here is meal number three. Really late, but some gas station chicken sandwich and a couple jalapeno poppers. All right, here's meal number four. Filet of fish and part of a cheeseburger and fries from McDonald's. Here is fifth meal. Midnight. Couple burritos before bed. Alright, today you got a Danish and some waffles. Alright, here we go with lunch. Two soft tacos from Taco Bell. Alright, and here is meal number three. Fruit pie and a taco. Okay, here we have fourth meal. I'm calling it dinner. We got a Danish and some chocolate Swiss cake and some pretzel pop tarts. This is meal number Plus five on the 17th. Right. Hey guys, it's me. I uh, It's four o'clock in the morning on Friday the 18th and I can't really sleep so I'm eating another meal. So I'll call this meal number one for the 15th and I'll eat maybe six meals today or just five we'll see uh but yeah we got back from our vacation at midnight and our asin's birthday is today so my wife went on a two-hour journey one way supposedly it looks like she just now got down there about four o'clock in the morning so uh I, I really can't sleep. I'm worried about her, and plus there's a lot of stuff I got to put up, put away from the vacation. So this is meal number one on the 18th. White Castle burgers and some caramel popcorn. Diesel hat. All right, here's like my meal number two on the 18th. Leftover. All right, here is meal number three, burrito, some Swiss rolls, and a Twinkie. Here's dinner, cheeseburger pizza. All right, here is meal number one, pretty pebbles with marshmallows. There we go, on the 19th, got some ramen noodles and crackers. All right, here is what well, should be fourth meal, but it's only third meal because I only eat this is gonna be the third time today because of garage sales. Uh, just chili dogs and a couple grapes. All right, and I just want to point out these plates here. Look at this. This one here. They're supposed. They look exactly identical, but this one's 1.5. I bought them so I could have a plate to weigh 
if the scale goes off with the food on it and just weigh the plate again so I can see how much food is on it when I need to. But look at this, 1.5, and then you come over here. I bought five of these. That one's zero. Let's do this one. That one's zero. That one's 0.7. So they're like all different weights, the plates. Like I got to this one over here after weighing them other ones. And it said 1.6. I was like, what the hell? So, so much for buying all the same type of plate with the same weight. That pisses me off. Right, and I got a glass of strawberry soda. All right, guys, the eight ounces is a little bit harder because uh, you're hungry before you get to the next meal. 10 ounces, you pretty much stay full, but it's a lot slower weight loss. And the last few days I did break the routine uh, several times. Like I ate a couple extra pieces of cake last night and I ate my son's leftovers from dinner which was pretty much cake and popcorn and to be honest with you the last week I've been doing stuff like that snacking here and there mainly because it was on vacation and things like that but let's go ahead and get back in the routine and uh, hopefully before the next weigh-in be back down to where I was at the 195 but this is what I'm eating this morning. Some sausage, egg, and cheese biscuits and some cake. I'm still eating that cake. That cake's some good stuff. It's got two layers of icing and pudding center with confetti cake. It's the bomb. All right, here we are on the 20th, meal number two. Got some hot dogs, donut, and grape. Alright, and here is third meal, cake, grapes, and a burrito. Alright, here is fourth meal. Just some spinach DiGiorno. It's not delivery. Alright, here is breakfast on the 21st. Full cereal. Alright, here is meal number two, 12 o'clock. Chicken strips. Eight ounces, some ketchup. Okay, meal number three, sandwich, cake, and tore up. Twinkie like cherry thing from the trip. Right here we go, meal number four, doing spaghetti with angel hair pasta and some orange sunny D. Hey guys, stay home dad here, and today is the 22nd, so it's Tuesday, and that is the end of the third week of March. We did go on vacation last week, that's why it was a two week uh video of eating and stuff i do know i gained some weight i did do a lot of splurging while i was on vacation eating stuff you know snacking here and there while i was driving drinking cappuccinos drinking pop pretty much two or three of them a day uh things like that let's just see how much i've gained Two or three. So there you have it. I gained eight pounds. So get back to it and stick to it, and maybe I'll lose the weight. Let's see how long it takes to lose it. I'm not going to record my meals anymore. It takes too much time, but I will do a weigh in every week to let you know where I'm at. Like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Uh, eight ounce meals. I'm only going to do four for this next week. Uh, instead of the five because I'm gonna try to get the weight thanks back for watching if you like the video and want to follow my process like share and subscribe
Thanks for tuning in. Hey man, while you're at it, check out my other YouTube channels. The Stay Home Dad, The Back End Handyman, The Dorcher Family, and The Average Stoner. Just a little bit of what I do from day to day as a stay home dad.